The National Health Service is the most civilised thing about Britain. It was created in the aftermath of the Second World War to provide health care free at the point of need for everybody. And those principles have survived and are actually very popular. But, and this is a big but, it is under the most enormous threat. The Health and Social Care Act of 2012 started down the road of further privatisation on top of the private finance initiatives that have built some of our hospitals. And we now have American health companies coming in trying to take over parts of our National Health Service. I warned against this in 2019 and was told it was all scaremongering on my part. We now have a number, a large number of GP practices run by a number of American companies and many more are sniffing around to take over our NHS, to take over diagnostic services, to take over all kinds of other services within our hospitals and our care sector. The only sensible way forward is for full public ownership of the entirety of the National Health Service and a national care service on the same principles as the NHS, care free at the point of need for everybody. So let us absolutely resolve, we will defend our NHS, we will campaign for a national care service. That's the only way of bringing about any degree of health equality in our society. Go to yournhsneedsyou.com and you'll find out what you can do to save our NHS.